Hello and welcome to the QA Underground. In today's video within the Introduction to VS Code series, we will be setting up an API test in VS Code using JavaScript. The first thing we want to do is open up VS Code and create a working directory. Before we get started writing tests, we're going to need to install some dependencies. We will need to install Jest for test execution. We'll then need to add types for Jest. And then finally, we're going to need to install the request-promise libraries. After those dependencies are installed, we're going to need to generate a package.json file. To do this, we're going to run npm init. Once we have the package.json file generated, we can now create our test. To do so, Within our working directory, we will create a new file using the naming convention nameoffile.test.js. Once we have the test file created, we will go into our package.json and update the test script to point to Jest. Now we are ready to write our test. First thing we need to do is add our dependency to request-promise-any library. The second step to writing our test will be to add our URL identifier. This is the endpoint that we will be sending our request to. The third step is to create our options identifier. This is where we will contain our method, URL, and request information we will be sending to the endpoint for our test. The fourth step to creating our test is to actually create the test. To do so, we're going to create a identifier named response that utilizes the await request from the request-promise-any library, and then simply output the status code from the response. And finally, we will do an expect that will assert the status code is what we were expecting. Once we have that, we can finally run our file. In today's video, we learned what dependencies we need to get started in API testing, how to initialize our project and use the project.json file, and how to set up an identifier, and finally, how to send an async request and validate the response. I want to thank everybody for joining in on this video. Please like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.